Never take financial advice from these four types of people. You know them very well. Now, if anyone can guess all four before I share them, I'm going to give you a silver coin because silver's pretty undervalued compared to gold. I love investing in silver and I'm in a generous mood. So this is an important video because free advice is worth every penny. And lots of people out there who've not got any money and are broke and are struggling are giving you advice for free on how to live your life. Now, you probably follow me because I've been an entrepreneur for 20 years. I became a millionaire before the age of 31, deck a millionaire before the age of 35. I've got 345 rental units and I've done a quarter of a billion in sales. Business and entrepreneurship is my biggest passion, my hobby, my life, my profession. And I've learned a fair bit in the last two decades. I've got wrinkles to prove it. So these four kind of people you should not be taking any financial advice from. Number one is friends and family. Now, friends and family may love you, but what they advise you on is probably to hold you back. Or maybe they sold themselves short. Or you being successful might make them feel a bit self-conscious. So inadvertently, your friends and your family can really hold you back, you know, like tying the hot air balloon down. So at the very least, know what their ulterior motive is. Now, sometimes friends and family really do care about you and they really do want to help you. But the problem is they're broke. (laughs) And if they're broke, that leads me on to number two types of people you shouldn't be taking financial advice from. Broke people. Like I said, free advice is worth every penny. But when you pay, you pay attention. So be very mindful because everyone thinks they're an expert now. There are these kids on TikTok giving financial advice. They don't even have pubes yet. They're not even old enough to get a kid's current account, let alone make a load of money. So be careful with broke people because they love to throw their free advice out. And, um, you know, you, you probably wouldn't um, have a personal trainer who's had a triple heart part, bypass operation. And if you're going to take advice from people about money and finances, make sure they're rich. OK, the third type of person I don't think you should be taking financial advice from is and this is quite a controversial one, but it's IFAs, um, independent financial advisors. Well, look. Maybe they know some things, but they're often not independent. The problem is they're going to get some nice commissions for the kind of investments that they're going to recommend. And so they've got an ulterior motive in what they recommend to you. And you need to know that they're unbiased and they're usually not unbiased. Um, there's a, there's a, I was going to say corruption. I think that's a bit strong. But there's some deals that are done where nice big commissions can be given for advising or referring certain products and services that might not be in your best interest. So at the very least, check it. What the I would probably ask your independent financial advisor, are you getting any commissions for this? Are you getting any kickbacks? Are you getting a referral? Are you getting any benefit for what you are recommending to me? OK, the fourth kind of person I don't think you should take financial advice from are college professors. You know, there are people in college teaching you business, finance and economics, and they're earning 40 grand a year. Now, look, you know, I said don't take advice from broke people. That's not me judging broke people, by the way. I, I will take advice from anyone if they are better than me or I want to be them in that area. So I don't judge someone if they're overweight, but really rich. I'll take advice from them on money, but not on health and vice versa. If they're broke. Um, But super lean and fit, I'll take advice from them on fitness and health, but not on money. So I'm not judging humans. I've just got your back and I want to make sure that you um, don't get sucked into taking advice from the wrong kind of people. Because the thing with money is everyone's got an opinion. And the thing with money is you being successful makes them look and feel bad about themselves. If you start to do well and win and make money, your friends, your family and people around you, your critics, and you're going to make them feel very uncomfortable about the risks they didn't take and the decisions they didn't make. Okay, 
So the college professors, the people who are teaching finance and business and economics, if they're only earning 40 grand a year, how can they give you advice on being wealthy? They can't. And also they're kind of a bit of a puppet for, puppet for the school system. You know, I believe the system wants you for four things. It wants you for debt, taxes, interest and compliance. It doesn't want you to question authority. It wants you to be in as much debt as possible so it can take as much interest from you as it can. And anything that you earn, it wants most of it in tax. And so the system, okay, you know, maybe there's some tech or new entrepreneurial courses that might have developed and be more modern, but most of the school system is outdated to kind of give you the factory line kind of job. Don't ask questions, don't challenge authority, do your job, pay your taxes, get in debt, pay your interest, die, pay your inheritance tax. It's kind of how the, the world's worked. So did anyone guess all four before I shared them all? Don't take advice from broke people, friends and family, IFAs who aren't independent, and then also, can you remember the fourth one? I just shared it with you. College professors who are talking about business, finance, and economics who are just over broke and in 40 grand a year, which, by the way, is a bit more than the average salary of a college lecturer and professor, which is bonkers. So look, I've made a quarter of a billion in sales in the 20 years I've been an entrepreneur and have 345 properties. I've got one of the top financial online schools in the country, Rob.team. And I have learned a thing or two about money, making it, managing it, mastering it. In fact, I'm author of the book Money, which is one of the top um, best-selling books on money in the UK. Check it out on Amazon. It's got thousands of reviews. And um, only this morning did it occur to me that I could invite you to my special Money Maker Summit event. Now, I've been doing Facebook videos every day for 10 years, give or take on average. And yet I've never invited my Facebook community to come and join me at the Money Maker Summit live. So give me a yes in the comments if you'd like to meet me personally. I'll happily sign your books um, if you've bought any of mine and have education, information, inspiration to make, manage and multiply money. Just type yes in the comments. What I'm doing this time round, I've got a couple of dates coming up. One start of October, one start of November, one in Peterborough, one in London. I'm actually going to subsidize 20 of you. Uh, and I'm going to get my foundation to pay for your um, tickets. Now, you can upgrade to the special VIP tickets as well, where you could meet me for dinner and my four other multimillionaire mentors, where you can do um, bonus Q&A sessions that are private with me and my multimillionaire friends, a champagne reception with us. You can get all of this for a little bit of an upgrade. But for the first 20 of you that um, type yes and request access to this, I'm going to actually subsidize your ticket. In fact, no, do you know what? Let's make it, make it official. What you need to do is you need to go to the link tiny.cc forward slash MMS live. That's tiny.cc forward slash MMSLIVE as in Money Maker Summit Live. Go right now because my live videos, um, the one I did this morning is pretty much just hit 100,000 views and I actually offered this there, so you're gonna need to be quick. And my live videos are getting 50 to 100,000 views a day. So you're gonna need to be quick. Go to tiny.cc forward slash MMS Live. I've typed the link, but you might need to type it into a web page. And, I'm going to subsidize the first 20 of you as long as you're committed. So my team will call you once you've registered on the page. They will just check you're committed, um, check that you're going to turn up and not just take a free ticket and then not turn up because that's disrespectful to other people who will miss out. And I'm going to teach you probably the six best business models for 2024 and 2025 to make passive and recurring income, to build multiple streams of income to make, manage, and multiply money. I've got probably six of my top multimillionaire friends teaching you their specialist expertise on starting a business online, low cost, high speed, you know, no stock, no staff, no overhead, no premises. As long as you've got the internet and a phone or a laptop, then we're cooking on gas live.
whether you want a side hustle or you want to quit your job or you want multiple businesses, I'm doing five keynote speeches. And the best one, I'm doing one of my keynote speeches is the eight stages of building wealth and becoming a millionaire, which I did 16 years ago, long time ago, got the grade to prove it. But my favorite talk is where I turn all the cameras off, everyone turns their phone off and I do a 90 minute talk on how to save millions of pounds in tax and how I've saved millions of pounds in tax. Um, I've got some really good accountants that I've built up over the years. Uh, I've saved millions of pounds legitimately. You know, these are things that you can find out if you know the experts and you know the law better than anyone else. And I'm going to teach you all of this at the Money Maker Summit. So you need to go to tiny.cc forward slash MMS live as in Money Maker Summit. First 20 of you who register and book a ticket with my team because my team will call you. I'm going to subsidize your ticket. The top VIP ticket. Oh. Um, I'm going to subsidize your ticket. And I think the standard ticket is about 300 quid. Three days training. You know, three days at college will cost you probably a grand. And you'll learn nothing. So, um, but you could also upgrade for a small amount of money. I think there's a 1,200 pound discount currently on the um, VIP upgraded ticket. Now, I don't just throw these discounts around willy nilly. We make special offers, you know, for my loyal and engaged community. I don't offer this on Facebook pretty much ever. So this is a unique opportunity. So go to tiny.cc forward slash MMS live. There's some details on the page. I've actually got a billionaire speaking at the London event. We've got a Peterborough event in what, two, two and a half weeks time if you want to cash in quick. But you need to be one of the first 20 because each round of events, I subsidize 20 tickets. My bad. I'm sorry that I didn't let you know about this sooner. I might have just thought about it. Um, yeah. So, um, quick summary. Do not take advice from broke people, friends and family, college professors, or independent financial advisors when it comes to money, because those people aren't independent. They have their own biases. They want commissions. They don't want you to succeed. They're told what to do by the system. So, Philip has said he'll secure his place. He's secured his place, so he's going to see me there. Yeah, Yolanta, there is an event in London in November and in Peterborough, which is just outside London anyway, an hour away in October. So, I'll see you at the link, tiny.cc forward slash MMS live. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks for following my work. Thanks for your comments. Thanks for stalking me. Thanks for being kind to me. Thanks for, the, for referring me. Thanks for criticizing me. Thanks for trolling me. Thanks for being alive at the same time in history as me. And remember, if you don't risk anything, you risk everything.